hello guys good day welcome to bms crypto youtube channel so here today we're going to be talking about uh, icp internet identity how to add your icp internet identity to another device right so here in this channel we talk about cryptocurrency we talk about air jobs DeFi, and many ways to make money in cryptocurrency right so here we'll be showing you how to actually add your internet identity to another device another phone entirely because when you clear your cache or your browser history on your phone that you're holding you will lose access to your internet identity if you also um lost your phone you've lost access to your internet identity because currently with your recovery freeze you cannot be able to access your internet identity as at now so maybe in the future it could be possible but right now you won't be able to access your internet identity if you lost the phone without having to add another device. So, literally, we're going to be adding another device to the internet identity. So, first of all, you have to log into your internet identity, right? Uh, internet identity wallet. Internet identity. So, when you log in with your anchor, um, this is it. so you i will show you how it goes in this video because it's very important here you can see where they say add devices right one over eight which means you can only add eight devices at the go so i will make a video on how to add a laptop but right now we are adding another phone right we are adding another phone so it's important that you add a phone that you own is either is your phone or the phone of someone that is your wife, your mom, your parent, or your brother that you trust. It has to be someone you trust that doesn't know much about this. Because if they know much about it, they could wipe your wallet, right? So you have to be very secured. So next is to add a new device. You can see here, click add a new device. It will show you warning that the process is add of adding a new device that... The person will have full control of your identity. Only continue the process if you want to add a new device that you are personally that you personally own, right? So um, we have to local devices mean that maybe the same device put in a different browser, like Chrome, Safari, or different other browsers. But remote devices maybe when you are actually adding it to a different entire phone or a laptop. So we click on a, a remote device so to to show us the process involved and we're going to, we're here to try it out so device registration is first of all this is the anchor 2094549 now steps to follow is enter the internet identity on your device click on add new device you will see manage existing device now, on the existing device, when you might click on manage it, it is a, a existing device. It will now show you where you put the anchor two zero nine four five four or any your personal anchor. Do not put this one right on that device. When you put it, you know it will now you click next, and it will now ask you what is the name of the device you want to put. You will now just put your device name like BMS or you know anything. So when you put the name. The next thing is to click continue. You have to do this in the time frame. This time that is ready now, right? So when you do this now, something will happen. We you know when you are pairing Bluetooth to another Bluetooth, it brings you a, a unique number. That when you put it on that num on that Bluetooth at that particular point in time, it links up, right? So if I do this now, I'm going to show you that a number will appear here that. I will, if I put it on this other device that I'm holding here right now, it will show like it will like link the two devices. Now I'm going to continue and I'm going to do this and you see what's going to happen now, right? Just watch. You can see it now. Now the device name is hello that's what i put as hello right and then the code they ask me for the verification code the verification code is is appearing on this phone i'm holding on the other phone i want to add so um the one that will not put it here 
on this device. And once I put it, it will add. Watch. I'm going to add it. I'm going to verify the device. Watch. I have added it on this device. It's have shown. Now, I have two devices here now. One is BMS1. The second one is Hello. So the second device is Hello. My first device is BMS1. Do you understand? If I lose access to BMS1, I will use Hello to access the internet identity and move any money that is inside. Or connect it to NNS, District, App, and the rest of them, right? Or this RV and move any NFT that I want to move that I got as an edge job, right? So if you lose access to one wallet, you have another one wallet too. So you can click from this setting to delete or do anything you want to do, right? So thank you so much for watching. Please, you can on notification, subscribe so you don't miss any other videos in this channel. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.